You're watching Mission Eyes. And tonight we're taking you to the reopening of the Mexican Museum. If you've been following the Mexican Museum story on Mission Local, you'll know that the museum was actually facing eviction as recently as September. I think so. The Mexican Museum has faced a lot of hurdles and struggles over the past few years, and this is their first public exhibit since 2006. Peter Rodriguez was a visionary, and one of the things that he did was he was able to create in San Francisco, through the Mexican Museum, a portal for Latin American art. He introduced a relatively unknown Frida Kahlo. There's been a lot of support from the city to get this museum back on track. Can you explain why that is? It's going to occupy the final uh, sort of parcel at the Yelba Buena Cultural Complex. It is part of the celebration of the diversity of San Francisco, and, and so the Latino community has to have this presence there. We're here in front of my very favorite piece in this exhibit. You have the, your basic Mexican nativity scene, but the fact is it's created by seven different artists. We have work from the 70s, the 80s, and the 90s. Different elements from different time periods of Mexican art all come together in this very contemporary mashup. This is the Navidad remix, and I totally dig it. We've seen the collection. There's about seven nativity scenes, all predominantly folkloric. Mm -hmm. Would you rate this exhibit a lump of coal or a great Christmas present? Well, you know, I'm, I'm really torn. As a, as a progressive Chicano artist, I see a lot of, you know, very light-skinned baby Jesuses here, and I have very mixed feelings about that. So I would rate this exhibit a Christmas sweater. It's, it's very practical, and it's nice, it keeps you warm, but occasionally they have funny designs like Frosty the Snowman or things that aren't, you know, it doesn't make it fly gear. So for the warm and fuzzy Christmas feeling that you're all longing for, come to the Mexican Museum? That's right.